Good afternoon, preppers. Welcome to Goshen Prepping. As you know, our food industry is in big trouble, even being sabotaged by our own government. Well, you have to see these articles because this is going to affect us all. First, U.S. farmer warns China is quietly taking over food security. And I know a lot of you already know this as China is trying to gobble up farmland. They're tapping into the American food structure and this country. And we should be looking at that as a food security. Absolutely. Farmers have voiced their concerns for more than two years over Chinese-owned companies purchasing large swaths of rural farmland in states like Oklahoma, Minnesota, North Carolina, and Virginia. And that's just a small sample. It's all over the United States. USDA data from 2021 indicates that China controls an estimated 383,000 acres of U.S. farmland, with their investments reportedly generating $1.9 billion that year. And of course, that was a couple years ago. It's far higher today. But it's far worse than that. Persons like myself, the person in the article, who can maybe pay, you know, four or 5,000 an acre, some of these farms are being run up to 15,000 or 20,000 an acre. Now, how many American farmers do you know can afford 20 grand an acre for good farm ground? Because I can't. And because of this, we're losing farms and this administration has done nothing to stop it. We have many of our members who are right now facing farm foreclosure because we had $1 billion to help Chinese farmers and other entities in Russia. When will this end? We continuously pump all this money into foreign aid, completely jipping and ripping off our own American people. And another article from Article Wisdom, you have to see this. It's not just the United States. Chinese companies are corralling land around the world. Look at this graph. Chinese companies lead in overseas land acquisitions. And this is important because look, in this blue area, this is just the agriculture. This is what we're talking about as far as them buying land in the United States and other places too. However, look at the forestry. They are literally just taking forest from all over the world and mining too. And you can see a very clear increase in the rise of overseas investment by Chinese companies going way up. So I'm going to say it again. This makes me very angry. And when is this going to stop? When are we going to have anybody in political theater going to put their fist down and say no more? This has to happen. I don't think it's ever going to happen at the federal level, by the way. I think our states are the only ones who are going to be able to put a stop to this. What do you think? Put it in the comments below. But as here we are, right in the middle of shortages, droughts, heat waves, I mean, even flooding in some areas too, supply issues, all of our different farmlands are in jeopardy. We see more and more Americans losing their farms because they can't afford them as we now sell them off to foreign investors. Chinese foreign investors, again, can't be allowed. Thanks for watching.